is no water to be had. This to wait. I think that's a. I think that's a new one. So I'm not going to go near that just yet. But this took an obscene amount of time, and I went through a pick and a half, or a pick and a half, a shovel and a half, before realizing that I should be using torches to drop the stacks of sand I was using to, uh, what do you call it, section off all the different sections to use with the sponge and rah rah rah, all that junk. So yeah, that's finally done. But that's not what we're doing today, actually. Um, I have gotten a few resources ready. I think that's a new one too, is it? Maybe? No, there's two together. I don't know. But they're always around my house. And always in the water. Like, get out. I don't need you. Uh, there's, yeah, as I was saying, I've gathered, 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 whichever, a few resources together. And we are going to be doing a little bit more building, which I know I've been doing a lot of. But, yeah, I'm kind of, I'm in the zone. I've had this idea in my head and I just want to get it. Get it to fruition, if you will. So I'm going to get those resources that I'm missing. Whoop. And then, yeah, meet you where we're building. Alright guys, so here we are. We're at the end portal. That's it right there. And what we're actually going to do... Sorry, just bear with me while I get rid of this junk. This junk here. Um, I should have done, like, done this about 30 seconds ago, but... Let me get rid of it. Ah! There we go. <laughs> um, so basically, what's going to happen is all down here and around, we're going to recreate the end. It's going to go up until about there, sort of thing. And so there is going to be a ceiling of glass, and then on top of that, which will kind of make it like a ceiling and floor of glass, Glass. It will be black stained glass, I think, would look best. I think. I don't know. We'll have to see. But yeah, then on top of that, we'll have the room with the portal to get here and beds and chests and all sorts of useful items. Things like that. So, I'm going to chuck all the end stone in and lay out where I want to put the towers of obsidian. I've got three stacks of obsidian and I'm... I'm almost sure that that is not going to be enough. It's, yeah. Oh, also, I should mention that around these walls are going to be black wool. And I'm not sure if I should make the room circular or not. I don't know how that would look. But for starters, I'm just going to make it square and see how we go. So, yeah, I'll get back to you with a progress update. Alright, so I've laid down the end stone here. Um, I'm going to put torches in all of these so we don't get any mobs and stuff. Um, I didn't put anything there and I'm just curious as to what to do. I actually have come across a dragon head which I very, 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 very sneakily got. Thanks to the help of Chris, <laughs> which is uh, Tech G. Now, I'm going to have to drop here. Yeah, I've laid down three towers, so one, two, and three. I've laid down some of the black wool. This is all the black wool I have left, actually, which isn't a lot. So we're going to need quite a bit. I think once I hit the top there, um, I'll use something else for the walls of the rest of it, kind of thing. So this I kind of just want to look like, you know when you look... Hold on, hold on. I have the perfect example. Let's just da, 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 da. Uh, gotta keep walking up that which looking at it like from that and that isn't exactly the best uh, thing for it I guess but it could be worse so maybe I'll make some endermen and stuff like that and they can instead of being carrying like dirt or grass or sand they can carry glowstone and have a bit of sneaky lighting in that way I don't know how I'm going to light up otherwise. I might have to just use like the yellow wool or something. I don't know. I'll work it out. See how we go. 
But I'm going to keep resource gathering. I'm going to build these towers up. And yeah, hopefully I'll come back to you when the black wool's like up to there. That's what I want. All right, here's kind of what I've done. It's not as much as I would have liked. I'd whoop, jumped up there. Um, I did one tower. This is obviously going to have to change to obsidian because I want to chuck some end crystals on there, which I think will look cool. Uh, that's still going to go about one, two, three, four, five, six blocks higher. So I only doubled it and that was about five stacks of black wool. Just to give you an indication of how much this is taking. Um, yeah, I got a beacon because I ran out of obsidian. And for some reason it was just playing out on me and I couldn't get it to give me haste too. And I rebuilt the beacon and everything and realized that something somewhere was blocking. I, I don't know. I don't know what was going on. But now we've got haste too as you can see. But I didn't feel like mining obsidian then. I felt like doing something lovey-dovey. So we are going to pay a visit to most of the United people, I think, because a lot of them, well, two of them, I don't know where they live, basically. I don't know where the bases are. So they're going to find their little love at spawn. Let's get to it. Okay. First up, Avalonian. Let's just um, pick a good spot. I have no idea where's. Oh, on top of his chicken coop! He should probably see that. Maybe. I need a couple of giddy uppy blocks. One, two. Okay. Oh, that's annoying. I can't put this directly in the center. Alright, let's just. I have no idea how to make a heart, so we're winging this, alright? Um, okay, let's just bring it out one more. And... I, I feel like... Let's, let's just look it. I feel like that just needs to go out too, kind of thing. If that makes sense. If I can get up, okay, so if I were to go, ooh, um, maybe just one? Oh, come on. I'm stuck in here with the chickens. Oh, there's, there it is. I was like, there's got to be a fence gate. There's always a fence gate. Okay, let's just shift. All right, you know what? That's about as hot as I'm going to get. We're going to... Are you a slime ball? Whoop, up. Space. Because you're... Oh, I hate bad grammar. Because you're making my piston sticky. You just fit. Boom. Okay. I feel like that's what a male would say to a female. I would imagine. The heart looks so terrible, actually. I think... I just kind of really want to get this right, you know? Let's get some more. This will do. One, two, three, four. I think what needs to happen is... Oh, that was close. This kind of like that. Now I'm just going to like that. All right. That's a bit better. Not ideal. A bit better. Don't worry. The others won't be this bad. <laughs> okay. Now to the next person. Hey, we're at Ash's base. Which looks phenomenal, if we can. And we're going to do a Reuben-themed little thing. I don't know <laughs> how much he's going to like this one. Are you a pig? Because I want a 
want to ride you. I'm not thinking of these by myself, by the way. Just to, um, clear this up. I kind of just wanted Minecraft-themed pickup lines that anyone could find, so it was pretty damn obvious. Like, nothing suggestive, nothing... Yeah. And can I just say it? Okay. So, Minecraft is aimed at kids, I know. And this crap, this is not aimed at kids. I don't know what your kids are doing these days. But it better not be that. So, off to the next person. Okay, so we're at Addictive G's base. And hers is going to say... Are you... Whoop, a lever? Because you're... Turn... Come on. Turning me on. There we go. Next pass. We are at Unholy's base, which it's looking like he was on pretty recently, because that's Endstone. So, that's pretty awesome. I haven't seen much from him, so it's kind of good to see what he's doing, getting horses and stuff, and portals, and all this kind of stuff. So, are you from the Nether? Because... You're out of this world. Man, I'm loving these. I just want to say it. I'm loving these. Okay, we are at Ahos's base. And I really want to turn around. But Jody has also pranked him. So, yeah. You'll have to wait for his reaction to see his base. Um, is that a creepy in your pants? Or... Are uh, you just happy? Come on. Happy. Damn it, happy to see me. Oh, just! Woohoo! Okay, so for these last two, I have to do them at spawn because I'm not quite sure where their bases are and how to get to them. I know that they're a really, really, really long way out and I, I was looking around the nether trying to find it, but. I can't, and I'm kind of running out of time. It's getting awfully close to Valentine's Day. So, what I've done is, this is Spawn, by the way. I've taken down the huge Biden statue. And Ahos is doing a little something-something. It looks gorgeous. And, oh, there's a creeper there. Let's just hope he doesn't bother us. And the first time I saw this was actually in Pog's video. That's the heart for Pog, by the way. And it surprised me, because I'm usually in and out of spawn all the time, particularly for all the black wool I've been needing. And I'm like, I swear I was like, what? It's changed. But I'm really glad it has, because Ahos is a phenomenal builder, as I've mentioned before. And it's just, well, I mentioned Ash was a phenomenal builder. But this is also, I know it doesn't look like much, but it's like for the word phenomenal, but he is actually a really, really good builder. That's Fury's praises enough. Anyway, let's get back to Valentine's Day here. So, for Pog is, I, mu I must be gravel because I'm falling. Oh, I don't think that's all going to fit. I'm falling for you. Oh, look at that. I guess it could work with sand as well, but gravel gravel's nicer. Like, I must be sand because I'm falling for you. It just doesn't have the same ring to it. And... Are uh, you a torch? Because you light, you light up my life. Ah, oh, how lovely. Well, happy Valentine's Day to the Uniters. Happy Valentine's Day to everyone watching. And happy Valentine's Day to just everyone who believes in celebrating it. And, well, that's just because I don't want to offend anyone who doesn't believe in celebrating it. But yeah. I'll see you later, guys.